You have spoken. Now President Biden and Governor Hogan learn what you think about the job they're doing. WJC is live in Annapolis this morning. Rachel Minitoff has more on this latest Gonzalez poll, which has some surprising results. Rachel, good morning. Tim, good morning. The Gonzalez poll interviewed about 800 Marylanders over a 10 day year. And in his eighth and final year, Governor Larry Hogan has a strong, favorable opinion from both Democrats and Republicans. And nearly three quarters of people polled approve of the overall job that he's doing. What's interesting, Tim, is that the Republican governor actually has a higher approval rating among Democrats than his own party. As for how he's handling the coronavirus pandemic, Governor Hogan is still showing positive numbers, with 76% of you approving of his decisions. But when it comes to President Biden, that approval rating is lower. Just over half of you still approve of the way he's handled COVID-19. And the number continues to drop to just 54% of Marylanders in favor of how the president is doing overall. And as Governor Hogan continues to show high approval ratings, top Republicans in Congress are urging him to run for the Senate and challenge current Maryland Democratic Senator Chris Van Hollen in the midterm elections. Governor Hogan has also been asked several times whether he would consider a run for the presidency, and so far he said no, he hasn't. Live in Annapolis, I'm Rachel Menatoff for WJZ. Rachel, thank you.